In this video we will go over some basic troubleshooting steps for a Samsung LED TV that has a blank screen but does have backlights. In Samsung LED TVs you can have differences in the number of boards. Most will have a main board and a power supply board while some may have an LED driver board and TCON board. This TV just has a main board and a power supply board. Here is the main board. And here is the power supply board. The LED driver can sometimes be built onto the power supply board as we can see here on this TV. The TCON board can also sometimes be built onto the main board or into the TV panel. This TV has the TCON board connection here and then it runs into the panel. Click the link in the video for more information on the basic functions of these boards. If you have a blank screen on your Samsung LED TV, the first thing you will want to do is watch our flashlight test video to help determine if you have backlights and if you can see an image on the screen when pointing a flashlight at it. Click the annotation in the video to view our flashlight test video. After running the flashlight test, you can come back to this video to continue troubleshooting. After running the flashlight test, you have now been able to determine if your TV has backlights or not, and if your TV has an image on the screen while using a flashlight. If your TV does have backlights but no image on the screen, continue watching this video for troubleshooting help. The first thing you will want to do is check the TCON board and the main board and give them a visual inspection looking for any burnt or damaged components. Here are some examples of what a puffy capacitor or burnt and damaged component will look like. If you have any damaged components that look this way, you should replace the board. If there is not a replacement board available, you can also try replacing the individual components or purchasing a repair kit. Removing and installing new components requires the ability to be able to solder. When looking for damaged components or burn marks, you can also look at the bottom side of the board. You would simply just need to disconnect all the cables and then remove the screws that hold the board to the panel. Be sure when disconnecting cables and removing screws that you take a picture of what the board looks like in the original state with all the cables connected and then you'll have a reference for when you reconnect all the cables. If you see any burnt or damaged components, it is recommended to replace that board. If you do not find any damaged or burnt components, then you can also check the LVDS cable to be sure that it is seated properly and that there is no damage visible on it. Here's an example of what an LVDS cable looks like. If you do see visible damage to the LVDS cable, you can search your TV model number on our website to try and find a replacement. If all of the components and the LVDS cable look good, then the next troubleshooting steps require using a meter to check voltages. If you are not able to check voltages, then the problem could either be with the main board, the TCON board, or the TV panel. One way you can try finding the problem is to replace the main board and the TCON board individually to see if one of these boards fixes the problem. This will require you to purchase both boards and then see which one fixes the problem or purchase them individually and see which one fixes the problem. If you are going to purchase multiple boards and replace them individually, before purchasing, be sure to understand the return policy of the company you are purchasing from as there may be restocking fees or parts that are not returnable. Here are some other videos that can help with Samsung LED TV repair troubleshooting. Click on any of the links to view the video. If you have any further questions regarding your repair, simply post a question in the comment section below. We strive to learn and share new TV repair tips every day. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and grow with us. Share our videos with your friends to help us spread the savings. And don't forget to hit that like button.